Hey everyone, it's Nancy with She's Got Yarn. I hope everybody had a wonderful, happy New Year's. Today's still to believe I've got all my packages sent out that I planned on sending to two Sophie books that I will be drawing for at the end of this video. So, whoever, whoever wins, I hope you do this because I might do not just one, but two. I don't know. I don't know. I have, I found a bunch of co ice yarn, cotton yarn that I bought. Me and Lynette were supposed to do a cotton, I don't know, a summer cover up and we never did it. It was from a new, I don't know, just life gets in the way. We get busy, but I bought all that yarn and I've got probably all the colors. And so I think I'm going to, I'm going to probably try to do Maybe a small one. I'm gonna try, because um, some people are doing one row or one round a week, and some are doing one round a day, I think. I don't know, but um, I'm not gonna leave anybody behind. Um, I might get left behind, I don't know. But I was told I would not, so. But I'm excited to do this, but I'm also gonna do it in the bobbins back there. Um, some of the, the only bummer about the bob is that the price was killer. I want to do it. I like the yarn. I'm probably going to hold two together, I think. I don't know. Um, they don't have, like, bright, bright colors. There's some pretty color. You know, it's all pretty, but I wanted some happy, you know, fuchsia. But, um, we'll see. I haven't picked out my colors yet. I first want to pick a winner for my channel. Um, let me see what else. I got a gift certificate to Joann's from my daughter and I got 25% off plus an additional 15% off. So I got 40% off my entire order. Yeah, yeah baby. Remember the other day I went and got Jiffy I think this yarn is so pretty. So I went and got one more of the color Slate. And it is the number five and it's 681 yards. Yeah. Yeah, baby, that'll do a cardigan for me. It'll do any type of wearable. And then there wasn't a whole lot of bright colors except one that I thought was kind of bright, and that was this color. Let me turn my light on. I'm sorry, guys. Oh, it's eggplant aubergine. Eggplant aubergine. Is that not beautiful? But I got two of them. And this is 100% acrylic, 14.5 ounces, 400 grams. 410 grams, 681 yards, 623 meters, 100% acrylic, and you can tell it's brushed acrylic, and it's machine washed and lay flat to dry, eggplants of color, made in Turkey, and this is a Lion brand yarn, an old favorite, made new again and bigger, so it's been quality yarn since 1878 and it is called Jiffy. So, I got two of those. And then I got two in gray. Y'all, I couldn't resist. This is, and then I got two in, well, what color is the gray? I always assume it's called Arrow. And then I got two in seafoam. So pretty. It's so squishy. And then I didn't get all the colors I wanted to. And then I got the color coastal. Does that look different? It looks like a different dye lot, doesn't it? No, I don't know. 
acne looks okay. It's the same dye lot. Okay. So we got that. One more caption of this beautiful, it's like a plum. That's the brightest color I think they had. They had harvest gold. They had, um, what was the other one? Harvest gold. And there was another one. No, I just drew a blank. I can't remember. They had other colors. Like a, um, like a, a rose mauve. They had that. But, yep. Don't know where I'm going to put them. <laughs> but, and before I pick a winner, I want to show you my finished, my completely finished all the ends sewn in. Woohoo! Y'all, I had so many ends. <laughs> but I got it done. I'm very happy with it. And somebody's going to love it. And then the red heart. Got that finally all. All the ends sewn in and I got it trimmed out with some ice yarn called Twist, something Twist. It's a discontinued yarn, but it had all the colors in this in these skeins. I looked for another skein in my stash in this color. I only had two large, and um, so I don't know. I'll just look out for it at Walmart. I'm sure it'll show up at Walmart again, but I had, um, I made several that I was thinking about just doing solids with. I haven't had time. I got one, two, three, four, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six. And how many was in? I never counted how many was in here. So one, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So I need six more. So that'll work out perfect. And I'll do like a neon purple, neon pink. Um, with my, I have the Premier Anti Pilling. I have green, purple, highlighter, orange. I have all those, all these colors. And I can do a solid and make another blanket. But I'm not going to do it for this year, maybe next year. But I got my squares made. And then I started playing with some of the ice yarns that I trimmed the one blanket out with. And this is, um, y'all, Michaels has a, oh, I can't think of the name of it. It's a really, it's a common yarn. Um, it's a solid, I'll figure it out in a second. I'm trying to see if I have some in here. I don't know, but anyways, I got a bunch of it at, um, Ollie's in this fuchsia color, but this is another blanket that I'll do. Here are the rest of my my um, scraps of love from Lynette. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And I have a lavender one, and I lost the ball. <laughs> I'll show you. These are the last two. This is so pretty, I never finished it. But these are the last two. I can't find this ball of purple. But I got plenty of this, I'll finish. So I have these two. So I'll have squares for next year's foggy. I'll probably make them before then. But it's not priority. It's uh, definitely not priority. Um, 
Just want to get these blankets. We're going to be taking the blankets to Orlando, or to, I'm going to pick Lynette in Orlando on the 5th, and I'll have all the blankets in my truck. But I did want to show you, I had um, shared some boggy blankets from YOH, that's Anita at Yarn Over Hook. She's a dear friend of mine. And I forgot, I get, they said I didn't show it on the night I unboxed them because I had opened it because there was a gift from her. And um, she had made me, she got me that pink shirt. It says lab, oh, not, is it lab squad? You guys, you saw the shirt the other night. It was pink, darn. But anyways, she makes these hexies. Is that not gorgeous? She sends all her sisters, her yarny sisters, these hexies. I'm gonna make, somebody said about, talked about making a bag. I would like to make a pillow. Actually, I would love to learn to make this pattern, but I think I'm gonna make a pillow and do a solid on the back. Cause I have, I believe I have these colors. And um, oh, they're somewhere here. Y'all, I've been moving yarn around <laughs> forever. Yarn, not forever fleece. Um, it's, it's premier the shiny yarn is what I have, so I've got tons of it. So thank you, Anita. And then I wanna share her boggy blankets because silly me thought, I, I thought I showed them, but nobody can seem to remember seeing them. But she made this one for Boggy Creek, <sighs> Camp Boggy, out of the bobbins. Is that not beautiful? I could have sworn I showed this. It's absolutely gorgeous. I showed it, but not on the live, I guess. I don't know. Y'all, I'm losing my memory. And not just one. She made this one too. Is that not beautiful? And if you guys are not um, a member, a subscriber of Anita's channel, you ought to go over there. She's also got a co-host, Nico, her uh, Palmski. He's Husky and Pomeranian. He's adorable. He's like a little Husky. He's really smart. His name is Miko, and I love him. I love them both. So, again, her channel's Yarn Over Hook. I'd like to get her monetized. So, you guys, please go subscribe to her channel. She's a sweetheart, and she specializes in amigurumis. But, I mean, she does beautiful. Look at this blanket. She does beautiful work. And she's a lovely person. So, so thank you, Anita, for participating. She does the Ami Wars. She heads up all the Ami Wars. So, you guys might remember her now if I say that. But, um, so I got my blankets done. I got all my ends sewed in. Um, my, my focus next, well, I'm making my husband a poncho and it's growing. It's here. Let me put it on. He, he loves this hush yarn. So what I did was I just did 24, 24 count on each side and then four on each corner to make the rectangle. And this is what I've got so far. Oh, y'all, I'm sorry. But that's what I've got done so far. We're getting there. I'm almost done. So I'm gonna um, do about two more rows or three more rows in the burgundy. Then I'm going to do the rest in um, the silver, the gray, and then I'm going to trim it out with the burgundy at the end like this. I may do another row on the collar. I don't know. I want to see what it looks like on Tim, but this is the first time he's ever asked me to make him something. So I'm, I'm so extremely excited to make him this. And so far, so, so far, so good. Oh, one of my bobbins. 
Zeus ripped the top off of this the other night. So, and then my my total 100% focus of the year. Hold on. Sorry. This is going to be my focus till it's done. Is my what is it? My comfiest knitted cardigan. And it's made by Mama and a Stitch. I've got several of her patterns, but um it's a pretty easy pattern. I had the wrong hook size. Um, so I may have to frog this. I don't know. Whoa. Hold on. But this is what I've got done so far on the back panel. It's an extra large. But I feel like it's, I don't know. But I'm a new knitter. It's not perfect. But I'm making this for a dear friend. And this is going to be my focus till I'm done. Um, every day I'm going to work. Um, Lynette got me the crochet tiles. And everybody's doing, I guess, a tile a week. Or a tile a day. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I'm going to do one tile a week. A different one. I want to do, I want to find one that I really like and make maybe one a week. I don't know. We'll see. I just, I'm just now starting to like, you know, squares. And none of these squares really match. I just can't see me making a hundred different squares if they don't, don't match. I mean, maybe I can find some that would match that I could put them together. I don't know. I haven't figured that out yet, but I do have the book. Thank you, Lynette. Got this for Christmas from Lynette. I'm gonna work on the tiles. I'm just not sure how. So, um, the other thing, so I've got, I'm gonna be doing a sweater, knitting a sweater. I'm gonna try to do, knit a sweater throughout the year. You know, every day work on some type of a knitted project. Um, so, because I have another sweater I want to finish after I get this one done. Actually, two. Um, so, we're going to do Sophie's. My sweaters, knit sweaters. Crochet tiles. And then, also, it, this is um, another from the same designer that, that, that made the sweater. I started this, we were doing one row a week. And like I said, with bogey blankets, we stopped everything and just focused on boggy blankets. But this is another pattern by Mama in, in a Stitch. It's a knitted cuddler blanket. So I've got some of it done, started, but yeah. And the yarn that I'm going to be using is Sugar Pom Pom by Baby B. It's a number, oh Lord. Y'all, I can't see that. It says it's a number six, but it's 70% acrylic, 17 polyamide, and 13 polyester, 52 yards. But I've got several i'm also using hometown in white i'm alternating i have hometown right there so just in case i don't have enough i have like one two three four five five skeins six skeins and then the white and i'm using number us 15 knitting needles so so I got two knitting projects going on and two crochet projects going on. I am done with boggy blankets for now, um, except two squares I wanna finish off. And I've got, I got, I got all my books out. See all my books? And I got all my books out over here. And I'm gonna, I'm just gonna go through them and see see what all I've got. I know I'm a terrible photographer. <laughs> I'm sorry. 
but um, yeah I'm just getting ready for the new year so you guys ready for me to pick a winner hang on I wanted to mention real quick I almost forgot um, on the crochet tiles uh, Sam with Manfas makes and Mike 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 they're the ones that are doing this so um, if you want to follow along with every single tile go over to her channel and subscribe um, I'm just joining in at the end they're like I'm they're on the 22nd tile um, I'm just joining in and I'm not sure exactly how I'm gonna do this I'm still thinking about that um, but yeah I wanted to mention that I almost forgot to mention that so yeah um, if you're not subscribed to Sam with Manfo's Makes, go on over there and subscribe. You'll love her and Mike. And also Anita Yarn Over Hook. It's y.o.h. Crochet. It's, and um, I think Mad Mimi and Lynette Charm Grammy and Jan with um, Crafter, Alaskan Crafter, and Elaine Brown. Um, Lynn Como, uh, I'm not sure if Lynn has, has a channel with content, but I'm pretty sure she does have a channel, but there's a bunch of us that are going to participate in this. And then again, uh, Sophie's Universe and, uh, Carrie the Crafty Elephant is, she's the go-to person. She's making like four different sizes, like yarn sizes, which is pretty cool. So anyways. I know this video is long enough. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.